Hey everybody, it's Mama J and I am here with another What Not Pickup. What did I get? Well, I got these. All right, guys, I was over on What Not and I was cruising around looking at vinyl albums. The seller was selling these. I thought they were kind of cool, you know, solid flashing and slower flashing. This was over 80s pop culture for life. I believe I got a sticker from him too. I did, it's right here. So that's pretty cool, but I was able to pick these up and some vinyl. So let's take a look at the vinyl I was able to pick up. A couple add-on items and I'll show you what I was shooting for at the very end. As you know, I find one item if I think the seller's a good seller. And if I see anything else I want, I will add it because you can get uh, cheaper shipping. So what I'm going to do is show you what we picked up. First one I got was this and it's Gremlins. This is story number four. These, I believe, because I also have this one, story number three. I believe there's like five or six of these, but these were made in 1984. These two are both sealed. I did pay like five bucks a piece for them, but I thought they were really cool. You know, I mean, they got little books with them, but just the fact the covers on this alone look cool. So these will go into my vinyl collection. I also was able to pick up this one, which I did not have. This is a seven inch vinyl. So these are a little smaller than regular vinyls. Go ahead and pull this out of plastic. Normally I don't buy seven inches, but when I seen this, I thought, oh, I needed to have this. There's John singing. This is pretty cool. Again, I uh, wanted to just add that to my collection. I paid like eight bucks for it. Seriously, eight bucks. I'd buy another one just for eight bucks. I can then display two of them <laughs> showing both sides, right? And then on top of that, I want a giveaway. And the giveaway I want, I have no clue. This is what I want. And it literally is Boozies, Bad A's, and Sea Murder. Now, I know nothing about this album. There's a song on side four featuring Snoop Dogg. This is a 2021 album. Again, I don't know much about it, but it was a giveaway. So there's a song by Snoop on here. I mean, if anybody out there is a fan, let me know. But otherwise, it'll just go in my collection. Not something that I'll probably ever listen to. And then what I was going for. This was a record store release this last uh, record store day. I was not able to pick it up, but it is the pictured Helter Skelter re-release. This picture is slightly different than the picture on the original original pictured album, which I'm going to tell you, I'm pretty sure I had. Again, as most of you know, I lost a lot of my albums when I separated from my ex, I don't know, 25, 27 years ago. In that case, I, I lost basically everything. So this is Helter Skelter. Again, this is a reprint, but that's why it's a record store only release. This is the back. It does have the four original members on it. So I was really happy to be able to pick this up. This is the back of the plastic cover and this is the inside, you know, where the album is sitting. So again, I was, this was my goal to pick up. The guy literally charged me for this basically cost. Um, yeah, I think right here it says $26.98 and I paid him like $30 for this. Oh, it's upside down. <laughs> I'll have to turn that around. But um, yeah, I paid him like 30 bucks for it with tax and everything. Yeah, And I didn't have to go fight any crowds. But anyways, I was able to add this. So I picked those up again from 80s Pop Culture for Life. I thought he had some pretty good deals and he was pretty interesting. He kept my interest while watching him. Anyways, if you enjoyed that video, give me a like and make sure you're keeping your eyes open. More to come. Bye guys.